Loose Women airs every weekday on ITV from 12. 30 p.m. but the show will be absent from its usual slot next week. The panel will kick off the week in the usual fashion but the show won't air from Tuesday onwards to make way for the ITV Racing Live reporting from the Cheltenham Festival. Next Tuesday, this morning will air from 10 a.m. to 12. 30 p.m. as usual. However, ITV News has been brought forward to air directly after the morning show. ITV Racing Live will then follow the news from 12. 50 p.m. until 4 p.m. This schedule will replace the usual schedule until Friday next week. Read more, next Tuesday, this morning will air from 10 a.m. to 12. 30 p.m. as usual. However, ITV News has been brought forward to air directly after the morning show. ITV Racing Live will then follow the news from 12. 50 p.m. until 4 p.m. This schedule will replace the usual schedule until Friday next week. Loose Women isn't the only ITV show to be involved in a schedule shake-up due to sporting events. Ant and Decca's Saturday Night Takeaway and the Starstruck Final have both been postponed. ITV viewers will be treated to a double dosing of rugby instead. Ireland takes on Scotland from 4. 45 p.m. while France goes up against England at 8 p.m. on March 19. The Dancing on Ice final will also be delayed due to ITV's sports coverage. Nottingham Forest take on Liverpool in a FA Cup quarter-final match. The game kicks off at 6 p.m. clashing with Dancing on Ice's usual start time of 6. 30 p.m. Fans of the skating competition will have to wait another week to see who will win this year's series. Only five couples remain in the competition with Paralympian Steph Reed losing out on a place in the semi-final last weekend. In the dreaded skate-off, the judges opted to save Olympian Kai White. Connor Ball, Regan Gascoigne and Kimberly Wyatt sailed through to the semi-final. Former Strictly Come Dancing professional Brendan Cole will also skate for a chance to be in the final. How well do you know your British soaps? How many times has Ian Beale been married in EastEnders? What is the name of Bianca Jackson and Ricky Butcher's son on EastEnders? On EastEnders in 2002, who accidentally ran Jamie Mitchell over in his car which caused his death. How many times has Corey Steve McDonald been married? What happened to Emily Bishop in Coronation Street? Who murdered Maxine Peacock in Coronation Street in 2003? Question mark which incident in 1993 killed off four characters in Immerdale? When did the show stop being known as Immerdale Farm? On what day did Holly Oaks air its first episode? What was the name of the much-loved Coronation Street pet dog who was put down in April 2020 after 14 years? Question mark 1996 saw the arrival of one of Hollyoaks' all-time bad boys and rival of Kurt Benson, but who was he? Who is the longest-serving character on Coronation Street? Who shot Phil in East Tenders? How many fires have there been at Corey's Rover's return? Get out of my pub, you're no soaps fan you're either too young to remember the big lines or have better things to do on weekday evenings casual viewer you watch them sometimes so you kinda know what's been going on die hard fan you love watching the soaps so much your entire week is planned around when they air at the end of last weekend's quarter final, host Philip Schofield announced a twist for the coming show. He said, there's something our couples don't know so listen up because we've kept this quiet all day. I can now reveal next week will be a double elimination. Loose Women airs on ITV on weekdays at 12. 30 p.m. 